Donald Trump was supposed to do an interview with the Shade Room, but he dropped out due to being too tired, sources claim. But as no interview materialized, Shade Room staff began feeling that feet were being dragged inside Trump's campaign. No date was ever set, we're told, but the intention was to try and work toward a sit-down, Politico reported. In a conversation earlier this week, when describing why an interview hadn't come together just yet, a Trump advisor told the Shade Room producers that Trump was exhausted and refusing some interviews but that could change at any time, according to two people familiar with the conversations. Meanwhile, Kamala Harris recently appeared on the Shade Room, a culture podcast that has predominantly young, black audience. But Trump spokesperson Caroline Levitt pushed back on the rumors, saying the ex-president being exhausted was unequivocally false. Trump, who has sparked concern about his mental fitness, appeared at a dinner on October 17, where he told a bunch of jokes, however a lot of them fell flat. He started off by making fun of Chuck Schumer, who was sitting right next to him. The press is reporting the Democrats are starting to panic. They're panicking. They are panicking because you know the votes that are coming in are coming in very, very strong a certain way. I won't tell you what way that is, but to Chuck Schumer is here looking very glum, Trump began. Doesn't he look glum? He looks glum. But look on the bright side, Chuck, considering how woke your party has become, if Kamala loses, you still have a chance to become the first woman president, he continued. He then moved on to bash Barack Obama and President Joe Biden. It was announced this morning that at a funeral yesterday, in a rare moment of clarity, Joe Biden told Barack Hussein Obama that. He said, only a few people got that. Or as Rush Limbaugh used to say, Barack Hussein Obama. Remember? He was a piece of work. We miss him. Trump was met with silence, as the audience didn't seem to laugh. The next day, while on Fox and Friends, he was asked how he comes up with his material. Well, I've had a lot of people helping, Trump replied. A lot of people. A couple of people from Fox, actually. I shouldn't say that. But they wrote some jokes and, for the most part, I didn't like any of them.